sold separately. <laughs> Bathroom. I cut my finger! <laughs> Wait, I'm like bleeding. <laughs>. Here's the fathom time. I have no idea how to do YouTube intros, so yo. What's going on? It was the middle of the summer. My parents had left for that weekend due to a work trip, which meant I was all by myself for the weekend. Also, I feel like I do have to mention that my sleep schedule was really messed up around this time. Wait, this is weird. It's He's not like shaping it like a game. I would sleep and get up at just about any time of the day, though I did plan on fixing that. Yeah, this person's just like me actually, holy. Damn, that's loud and annoying. I woke up around eight after a nap that evening. Can I run? Seems like a normal day in the suburbs. Hmm. Stop. I did have homework that night. I didn't read it. I, d I really did have, have to do homework, but as I said, I had to eat something first. I wanna, ha, ah, holy fucking Christ. All right, yo, what up? It's your boy. Hello, mom. Why are you being so paranoid? I'm 14, think I'm gonna take a little nap. Probably gonna order some pizza. No need to order anything, already made you lasagna this morning. I fucking hate lasagna. Mom, this is a bad move on your part. Lasagna, I can throw it. Nice. Can I eat on the couch and just watch some TV? Oh, do I have to warm it up? <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry, I thought I was gonna eat cold lasagna. There's a microwave. Or do I do oven? Oh, they don't, they don't own a microwave. Gordon Ramsay would be proud of you. All right, let's go enjoy some lasagna and watch some cartoons, shall we? This is my favorite show. Is it, yo, is this why? What is that? What was that? I saw someone, I swear, what the fuck? Oh, I hate it. What is that noise? Is that eating? Why am I making so much fucking noise? Holy shit. I guess I'll just keep eating and act like nothing fucking happened. I got like actual chills when I was walking up the stairs. What? What the fuck is that? Jesus Christ. Most intense fucking scene in the entire world. We're gonna have to call it off, man. Something just came up, but you gotta come to Jessica's tomorrow. My parents are out. I want to come over. We can play Mario Kart. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up. Not tonight. Unfortunate. Mason is busy. Sorry, Miles. Got to see you tomorrow. Don't forget Kem, though. Chill out, dude. All good. I'll probably just go back after... Wait, go go back to bed after Kem. I'm going to go to sleep. I remember I had homework to... Oh, motherfucker. 12.38 a.m. Ah, what, mother? Don't stay up too late. I shouldn't get to hear from Mrs. Paula this time. Who the fuck is Mrs. Paula? Okay, fine. I'm going to bed. 1.16 a.m. Dude, this kid is just like me. Nope, go back to sleep, please, for the love of God. I swear to God, someone's gonna like peek around the corner. Please stop, please, for the love of please stop. Dude, these sounds are fucking obnoxious. I gotta read the subtitles. I gotta get water. Water? Yeah, this is up. Damn. Is it good? What? Ha! Ah! Oh, fuck! What? Who is that at the door? Said he's been creeping through the windows. We're calling the cops. You you kids lock every door and hide in your room. Don't answer the door. Okay. I gotta hide. I didn't lock the door. It doesn't matter. He broke the damn window. What? What's going on? Hell no. Nope. 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 Sorry, I'm not home right now. Wait, what if it's the pizza? Oh. <laughs> Guys. It's just it's just the pizza. It's Paul at the door. You said to not answer the door for anybody. I don't trust that at all. Nope, I'm not answering the door. Mom's so sorry, honey. Yeah, you're a fucking NPC. What am I doing? God, I'm fucking, I'm curling my toes. What do I do? 5-0. Wait, do I, did I win? Let's go. Wait, who the fuck was in here? Wait, wait, this is where they broke in. And then it just closes. <laughs> uh, do you guys want to watch the, the bad ending? I'm curious. Wait, this is a fucking video. I'm not even playing the damn game, motherfucker. Let's play the second one. 
I'm curious. This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how cre creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the... For the internet at first but getting it out may help even if it just is a little bit i was one of those people that loves gaming conventions i go to every convention i get the chance to and sometimes even meet some of my online friends that's what's up no my parents weren't weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives but a plane ticket would have been too expensive this convention i was at went great and it was now the day to drive back home but when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over a 12 hour drive. WAS indeed a drive. Wait, I can drive? What if I just crash my car? Okay, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Driving is very therapeutic for me. Well, at least it used to be. I'm the same way. Aiden, what up? That's it, I'm rerouting here. Do what you gotta do. Drive safe, Holly. Thanks, dad. This is really chill. Doesn't seem to be any other drivers, so I can drive like a fucking maniac. Ah! Hi, Dad. Where did you reach? What are you talking about? Still about six hours away from the city, got stuck in a jam. Yeah, this is literally a POV of me going out at fucking 3 a.m. to 7 Eleven to get some snacks. What is that? You're halfway through the driver, realized I was low on gas. Oh, Christ, you're fucking dead. Oh, God. Told you to take that flight. Okay, Dad, shut up. Oh, Holly, it's gonna be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling all right. I'm feeling great, Dad. Better than ever. Yes. Can I get gas here? Hi. Give me. How's your night going? Where are you headed? Oh, is this a customer? Oh, I'm dumb. Oh, God, you are fucking creepy and ominous. I'm gonna look around. Maybe I can get myself a good cola. Yeah. <gasps> yes. I love me an orange soda. I'm just gonna throw things around on the floor, see what happens. I'm gonna mess up. Nothing. It's all him. It's his fault. Look. Look. All the things are around him. I'm done. Hey, can I get some gas? <laughs> You're heading to the bridge by yourself. Uh, the bridge? The Norwood Valley Road, I mean. Not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Be careful. What do you mean? For about a century, now many people have been going missing down there. And people who went looking for them never returned. Locals say the Northwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down from the trees. Cool. <laughs> I'm gonna say that. Cool. And one more thing. If you see a woman in white or a blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just step on the gas as hard as you can. Who is she? Some people say that she died in a car accident there on prom night. Some say that she seeks vengeance after she was murdered there. Whatever you do, never ever under any circumstances pick up a hitchhiker. There's people out there on the road putting their thumbs out. They ain't what you think, ma'am. They just ain't. Will do, Waldo. Thank you very much. Let's ask this guy. Huh? Big mistake. Okay, hey, sorry to upset you, fucking uptight loser. Who's that woman? Oh, wait, I don't know if you find any shop at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Could you get some for my little piggyback? Wait, do you got any dog food? Wait, there actually is. Give me this. That'll be five dollars. That person was near my car though, but they were in a van. All right, I filled the tank and I was off, off on the road again. All right, here we go. All right, on the road again. Oh, what happened? That person fucked with my car. Yep, we're dead. Did you check the back seat? Don't fucking say that in my chat. Oh my god, I can't even check it. That is that is terrifying. I've had that real fear in real life. Oh, this is the bridge. Okay, go, just go, go, please. Let's go straight across. I don't care if there's a woman in the road, in the middle of the road. I'm not stopping. I don't care. I'll hit you. I will run you straight fucking over. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't see. Don't care. Hitting the bunny. This is a very weird thing about. What? Oh, oh my god. Move it. Hurry, please. Oh my god. Yep. Yep. Going great. Get the fuck out of here now, please. What? Ha! Ah, what happened? I'm trying to look in the fucking trunk. What do I do? I know I'm smoking. That's why I can't drive forward. I'm not saying that I was starting to believe whatever the bullcrap was at the gas station in the court. I'm gonna carry this so I can throw dog food at people. I don't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but... Ha! Ah, what the fuck? I just felt my fucking ground move. I hated that. I saw a car nearing. Don't get in the fucking car. Wow. Thanks. That person is smart. I would've left me too. I don't blame him at all. Oh! No, no, no! Stop! Oh, we did! May I get a ride or a tow? One or the other? Or some help on the engine. This is the guy! Wait, this is the guy from the thing. You're the girl from the gas station. Hi, thank you so much for stopping. Didn't think it. What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. 
I can't call for help. There's no phones. This guy's bad. Where are you heading to? Just to the nearest stop where I can call for help. That is probably what I should not say. Just up the road. Hop in. Thank you so much. Could, could you wait till I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the back. I won't be here for too long. Okay. I have so much shit! I'm ready. Finally. Now hop in and be quick. Let's get a move on, shall we? Thank you. So you won't tell me who you are or where you're going. I'd rather not say if that's okay. If you say so. Do not pick up a fucking hitchhiker. Wait! That guy warned me to not pick up a hitchhiker. I must say you're one brave young woman. You got any clue what happened to your car back there? It never broke down on me like that ever before. My dad's is pretty old. I mean, he seems like a normal conversation. Seems just like a regular guy. So what do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? He really creeped me out. I'm gonna say that. I'm not gonna say he's fucking funny. Interesting. Oh God, never mind. You're weird. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. <laughs> so is it true? What, the monster? Let's see, I've never seen a monster for myself, but there are, there are some things. And I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. Hey, listen, I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them and you don't be bothered. Who's them? You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. I can tell. But that's okay, man. We all have a little bit of social anxiety. He's not bad. After a little small talk, he dropped me by my motel. Look! Apparently they offered roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there are all kinds of people out there, I, he said ominously before leaving. Okay, where am I going? Is this the main entry? What up? Gal need a room to shack up for the night? How much is it for a room? Um, yes, I'm only gonna be here for a few hours. 40 for single. That's really fucking cheap. Talk about the car. $90. Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take it very nicely to it. Oh my god, mom. Calm down. Jesus. Wait, those didn't send. Where's my mattress? Couldn't have slept there. Where do I sleep? Sold separately. <laughs> Bathroom. <laughs> The fuck are you and why are you in my fucking bathroom? I broke my fucking headphones. Hold on. I cut my finger. <laughs> Wait, I'm like bleeding. <laughs> I gotta get a towel. I'm like bleeding bad on my finger. <laughs> All right, I'm back. I actually cut my finger really deep. Like it is bleeding very much. <laughs> Oh, I cut it on my headphones, I think. I have blood on my headphones. Let's continue playing the game, shall we? <laughs> Who are you? I'm Tommy, room service here at Roadway Inn, the finest stopover in Norwood. What were you doing in there? You know, cleaning stuff. Guy at the front desk gave me this room. He 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 he. Wait, I'm gonna have to ask why you- Pessy, you're a banana. I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I mean, f fine, give me my fucking mattress. Oh yeah, I gotta get my stuff. Where did I put my stuff? I have so much shit. That was like the worst jump scare I've gotten in a while. I wasn't expecting somebody to be in my fucking motel room in my bathroom. Are you done? Had a word with Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, what? But don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. And also the room's phone is not working. If you need anything, just ask at the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. He 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 he. But you have a good night. Thanks, man. Have a good night. Fucking goofy ass walk. Get the hell out of here. Get out. Wow. I love Superman. I can't get up. Hang it up. I, I, I just, no, I, ah! Hot cup of coffee could help, I thought to myself. Can I order a hot cup of coffee? Why do you want me to hide in the closet? I guess because it's a creepy guy? Is there a microphone? No way this game can fucking hear me. Penis in my asshole. Yeah, so, okay. Let's go to the office. Yo, your employees scared the living fuck out of me. You have a great night's sleep. Thanks. Wait, where's the coffee? Yeah, I remember the fucking, the, uh, the game told me to get coffee. Do I get it from the vending machine? There's no way there's coffee in the vending machine. Oh, there it is. It's gotta be this. Let's get a, I would get a cappuccino. Consuming these items helps you stay awake. Yeah, I just got drugged. Did I actually leave my door open? Oh. I, oh, wait, I, I was joking. Wait, I actually got drugged. Everything is reversed. Can y'all read that? I'm gonna get back to my room now. There we go. Go to go to sleep. Hello. 
That's a disturbing and uncomfortable sound. Can I leave? Wait. Did somebody knock on the door? Can I look through the peephole? Wait, no, it looks like him. I'm gonna go in the closet. I'm gonna hide. Did I die? Mother. Okay, we gotta do the motel over again. I wanna see the other ending. I'm skipping through all this. I'm getting to the part where I need to be at. See you later. It's taking me with him. <laughs> where are we going, big boy? Where's he going? Oh, fucking Christ. Okay, later. So I have to, I think I have to get coffee to progress the story. Whoa. What up, dad? Can't read your message, not even gonna look. Okay, go to bed. All right, let's actually answer the fucking door for Joe, shall we? 3.18 a.m. Yeah, wait, first off, why is he fucking knocking on my door at 3 a.m.? Huh! Were they watching me sleep? I, I still can't read. Didn't feel safe going out. I don't feel safe in my room. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, hey. Joe. Yes. Who is it? Joe from the front desk. Open the door. Open the door. Hi, Joe. Please save me. Didn't I specifically tell you not to wake anyone up? Huh? I have complaints. What are you making? I didn't even do I didn't do shit. Somebody's telling you lies, Joe. They're fibbing. Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. Is that why are your eyes all red? Mention the coffee machine. Joe might be chill. Are you messing with me? We don't have no coffee machine over- Huh? I've had enough of you- Of your crazy goons here. For once, I thought we had a sober guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. Follow me. I hate my job. <laughs> There's a dude in my closet. Are we just not gonna do anything about that? It was right here, Joe, I swear. I said go back now. Check the table by the TV. Fine, I'll go back, Joe, but I'm not crazy. You saw the guy leave? Did I? Oh my God, he's, he's, he, he's gone. Huh, ain't no fucking way. That's not free. That's not Joe. Looks like the dude in my closet, I'm hiding. Hello? Boo. Hello? No. I, I want I yelled so loud, but I forgot that stream couldn't hear me either. <laughs> oh yeah. No. Damn, holy fuck! I'm rude! Run! Get his ass! That's what's up, Joe! Shut up, funny! To this day, I find it really weird that the manager interfered, inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived with the car after what he felt, after what felt like a year. I never went on long road trips again. I always, I would always take airplanes. Jesus Christ. I had to talk to the guy like three fucking times. I, I've never not talked for that long in my entire life. I hated it. Sold separately. <laughs> Bathroom. <laughs> the same thing happened to Droid. I want to see Droid's clip if he, if they, do you guys have that clip maybe? 